Today, we're going to test drive the 2022 Genesis GV80. So you can see the driver doesn't have their hands on the steering wheel in the GV80, but with the lane assist feature, it is handling these gentle highway curves on its own. Another excellent feature of the Genesis GV80 is how quiet it is. So it has these double paned glass windows. And right now I have the radio off. You can hear driving 68 miles an hour. There's very little exterior noise coming into the car. Fun fact, this car is only one decibel louder on the interior than a Rolls Royce Cullinan. One thing that I ding for this car is the steering wheel. I would give it a six and a half out of 10 perhaps. Uh, ergonomically speaking, it is a little bit clunky in your hand. The cross section shape of it, I am not a fan of. Right now as well, I have a nice air breeze coming through the seats that have perforations in them for air conditioning seating. A nice feature for your passengers in the back of the car the rear seats are able to recline. The gear shift is simple and intuitive, similar to other luxury SUVs. The car has a handy blind spot feature. The moment you put on the blinker, it illuminates a camera showing your blind spot right in the gauge cluster. So who is the typical buyer of a Genesis GV80? Well, this car is comparable to similar makes, excuse me, similar models by uh, everybody is putting out something in this category. Audi, Mercedes, BMW, Jaguar, Aston Martin. But perhaps at a significant discount to those wrapped up in a luxury package. Anyways, YouTube thinks you'll like this video next.